Like about the Scottish movies, and it's Monday, and it's Blu-ray hunting day, and yeah, I've got another day off work. This is my final Monday off work in November, um, so I'm a bit gutted about that. I've been enjoying having my Mondays off, but um, yeah, um, so I thought I'd uh, get out there and uh, see what see what's out today. Um, first stop of the day is going to be Asda, and um, they've probably got nothing out. Um, as I say, I'm not actually sure what's out today anyway, so this is going to be fun. But yeah, we'll check out Asda and then I'm going to go to the town of Altrincham. I've got need to go see extra tray stuff in as per usual. And um, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so here we are at Asda, we'll go in and we'll see what we can find, and the uh, first thing I'm seeing is a lovely teapot from Alice in Wonderland, I think it's 12 quid, that's pretty cool, and a stitch plate there, oh, looking like they've got all this stuff out for Christmas, and we've got some pretty cool mugs here, we've got a I am Groot, and we've got Mr Potter, oh they might have just broken him, uh, Cheshire Cat, um, We've got Wank and Sully from Monsters Inc. Um, we got, of course, we've got Baby Grogu there. That's cool. We're over to the um, media section here now, and first thing we've seen, we've got our DLA two for twelve. Is that? We've got Godzilla Kong, that's of yours nine. Suicide Squad. A few Christmas movies there. There's a Snowman, Christmas Vacation. Uh, some Marvel stuff down there, and. Up here we've got, on DVD, we've got Double Pack Top Gun, Top Gun Maverick. Great film, probably in my top two or three of the year for that. Um, and then we've got Fisherman's Friends 1 and all. Uh, seen this movie, it was really good. I'm a big fan of the Fisherman's Friends movies. I've, I've not actually picked that up yet, though. Uh, I think this was a new release last week, a nice shiny slip on the Halo. I remember we used to play the game, the game was great. I believe this isn't brilliant, though, the show. I think this might be a new release this week, Idris Elba and Beast. I've seen this movie, this was pretty good. Um, and this might be another new release as well, Fall, with two silly girls that sit stuck on top of a tower, but it's, it's really good as well. Um, and over to the Blu-ray section here, and I've got some, uh, what's this? Bodies, Bodies, Bodies. Uh, I think this is a new release this week. I don't know anything about that, it might be some sort of horror film. Uh, and also this week, this is new, is uh, we've got Westworld Season 4, is that? I've never seen any Westworld. Comment down below for Westworld's worth, worth getting into. Um, and then the rest of the Blu-rays, pretty much stuff from the last few weeks. Uh, we're going to check out some clothes now. We've got all you know, the England shirts out for the uh, World Cup. We'll probably get eliminated by the time you see this video. Um, around here we've got, oh, a lovely... Lovely Rudolph uh, jumper there, and also this pretty cool Joker shirt. I don't like that. That's pretty good. And uh, we're in Altrincham now. We're going to go into our first charity shop, and uh, that is going to be Saint Anne's Hospice. See if they've got anything. Uh, yeah, the first thing I'm seeing here, we've got a couple of Blu-rays. We've got Dark Knight there. Um, I think they've got Batman Begins or Ends or whatever it is. They've got the next one anyway, I think. This is a good movie from the 90s with uh, Millie Gibson. Got uh, Ransom. That's a good, good movie. Um, what else have we got? These, we've got loads of DVDs in there. Um, got Drive with a nice slip on Blu ray. Um, anything else we can see? Uh, Zephyr Rim Blu-ray lodged in there, and we got some bit of Nicholas Cage of John Cusack Frozen Ground. Don't know anything about that. And uh, next stop, we're going to check out the Entertainer. See if there's any pops. Um, and yeah, we're straight to the pops, and we've got. In fact, 
It's turbo time. Put the cookie down. 35 quid. I need to get one of them. Uh, I mean, I've got some uh, pops here from um, Wakanda Forever. We've got no more. That's pretty cool. I like these. I think these are all £11. Um, we've got another one here. We've got Ironheart. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. And there's a couple more there. Nik Nikaya and Okoe. Probably watched their names. And just for Christmas, we've got these DC superheroes, Gingerbread Men, Superman, Batman, Flash, Aquaman, Wonder Woman. And... It's a me, it's a Mario. Got some Mario uh, toys there. 60% off, that's pretty good. And over here we've got some Star Wars stuff. There he is, oh baby Grogu there. And uh, we've got some figures with Mando himself there. And I don't know if that is on the side, is that? Um, no, I don't know. We've got um, the Dark Saber there, that's cool. And the Boba Fett helmet. And off we are. Going now to CEX. Uh, let's see what we can find today. The Blu ray section. First thing I'm seeing is this is a pretty cool four movie collection of uh, Arnie, Terminator Predator, Commando, and Conan. I've got all but Conan there, so it's not worth me picking that up. We've got the um, original Amityville there for £6. Um, what else we got? From Doctor Who there. What's that? It's 30th anniversary Dirty Dancing. Uh, I think you might have seen that film before. Um, down here we've got Doctor Strange there, 4K. And uh, I think this is a Spielberg film. Uh, I've got this on DVD, I've never actually seen it. Empire of the Sun. Come on down below, it's worth, worth checking out, guys. Um, what else can we see? Great showman there, a bit of Godfather. And uh, down there we've got a heat. There's two lots of heat there, some with Sandra Bullock. And uh, we've got some Christmas movies there. We've got It's a Wonderful Life. I've never seen that movie. I do plan on watching that hopefully this year for the first time. We've got lots of Jurassic Park, Jurassic World. Um, and up here we've got, we've got Glass Running. Onion coming on Netflix soon, it's in the cinema now. I see uh, original Knives Out, it was a great movie. And uh, this is a good deal for just £5. I don't think this has been out too long. Phantom of the Open, yeah, that's 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 a really good price. Got some Rambo there, uh, Star Wars, uh, anything else? And we got a bit of uh, Mr. Hitchcock Saboteur, don't know anything about that one. That'll be pretty good though. And there's Tarzan. I think that's it for today. And we're back home again. Uh, and it's been a good day. Um, yeah, went up to Altrincham, uh, went up to Asda. I'd, uh, um, see what they had, see if there's any new releases out. Um, I think, uh, I, I didn't know when I went in, but I think it was Beast come out today and fall and, and looks like bodies, bodies, bodies. I was quite surprised as they didn't have uh, maybe a Blu-ray of, of fall or uh, as maybe definitely Beast. Well, they did have bodies, 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 so it was a little strange. I don't know if they are on Blu-ray and they just not put them out, but um, yeah, but it was good to see them on the shelves. Um, and then I went into the Sound of Altrincham, went to a couple of charity shops, uh, had a look in the entertainer, I went to uh, CEX, uh, where I did actually have um, some stuff to trade in. So I'm going to go through my pickups now, I've only got the two, and I did get them from CEX. Um, I traded some stuff in, uh, I'm going to show you the voucher here, and I got £28.30 I think it was, voucher. Um, I, I had some vouchers left anyway, um, as I, as you usually do. Um, but I did pick up a couple of titles from CX. Now the first one I picked up is uh, a TV series. Um, well, it's it's part of a TV series, um, and well, I'll show you what it is. Basically, it's twenty four living of a day, and this was two pound on DVD. I've got um, the box set of twenty four seasons one, two, eight. I think it is plus Redemption. Uh, this is the only one that's not in the box set, uh, if you don't count the um, the reboot they did with, without uh, Kiefer Sutherland, which I'm, I'm not going to count. Uh, but, um, 
Yeah, this is the one where he went to, I think it was London. It was kind of like a 12 episode series where they skipped 12 hours. If you know 24, you'll know what I mean. But um, I remember it being pretty good though, and I wanted to complete my 24 collection. So, uh, yeah, happy to pick that up. And uh, yeah, so that's that's 24, live another day. And the only other item I picked up was a Blu ray. Um, and uh, I think I've this is a double pack of two movies. Now, I think I've definitely seen the first one. I'm not 100% if I've seen the second one or not. But for four quid for a double pack, I thought it was a pretty good deal. And that's Sin City and Sin City 2, uh, a Dame to Kill for. Uh, yeah, that double pack there for uh, four pounds. So I thought that was pretty good. You've got, oh, we've got artwork on one disc and not on the other. So, yeah. Um, well, I remember liking Sin City back in the day. It's been ages since I've seen it. Um, and like, as I say, I'm not 100% if I've seen the second one. I can't, can't recall, but before quid, I thought it's a pretty good deal. So, yeah, pick that up. And that is it for today. As I say, I've got myself a uh, load more vouchers left now. Um, I'm probably going to hit the CX online because um, I want to pick up um, uh, Jurassic World Dominion on 4K again. Uh, if you've seen from some of the oldest videos, I have um, picked up previously from CX and it come with a damaged case. No slip cover, which I could have lived with, but the, the, the case was damaged. I wouldn't mind it being out about a day. So I don't, I don't know what happened there, but... Um, I'm going to uh, risk it and um, get another one of those online, so you'll probably see that in a future video. Um, and yeah, that's it for today, really. Um, yeah, comment down below uh, if you're a fan of 24, if you've if you, uh, seen them all, if you've seen this, this sort of um, extra one that they released. And uh, also if you've seen City Sin, Sin, I can't get my words out, Sin City or the sequel. Um, I remember them being pretty good graphic novels, sort of movies um so yeah uh don't forget to like and share and subscribe and i'll see you next time bye guys